Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to resolve if you're having issues with a Valorant's graphic driver crashing. So this should hopefully be a pretty straightforward process here, guys. And without further ado, let's go ahead and jump straight into it. So first thing I would recommend doing would be to open up the search menu, type in device manager, best match, or come back with device manager. Go ahead and open that up. You want to expand the display adapter section by double clicking on it and then right clicking on the display adapter that's listed under here. Select update driver and select browse my computer for drivers and then select let me pick from a list of available drivers on my computer. Select the manufacturer specific one unless there's only a generic driver in here in which case you have to select that one. But we're going to go ahead and select the manufacturer one here and then select next and give that a moment. Close out of here, and I would suggest restarting your computer. You may also, if you're still having an issue, go on to the manufacturer's website of your display drivers. So let's say you're going to go on the video, or if you have AMD, it doesn't really matter. But So in the Google, just want to search for either AMD or NVIDIA's driver detection tool. So we can use either or, but in today's tutorial, we're going to assume you have an AMD GPU. You might have a NVIDIA or an Intel, but for this purpose, it's a pretty similar process. We're just going to use AMD for this tutorial here, so the auto detect utility, I'm going to go into select the auto detect tool link here. It says how to get it, so just select download and set up. And we're going to navigate to the AMD driver and support page. It looks like they really make you redirect around to get to this. But you can also go up to the top address bar and just type in amd.com forward slash en or whatever localized version of the web page you may need to access, but it's fine if you select the English version here. And then forward slash support, and then it'll take you to this page. So you can just kind of skip that other steps I was just showing you, kind of navigating all these different references that so they are linking you around to just go right here. So anyway, I'm going to go ahead and select the download Windows drivers button on this page. And I'm going to give that a moment here. Go ahead and download that. Select yes. And I am going to select install. Close out the web browser at this time. That is fine. And just give that a moment here. So I don't actually have any AMD hardware on this computer. So that's why it's giving me an error. But you guys get the point. It should be a pretty automated utility from here. So hopefully, again, that would have resolved the problem. If you're still having an issue, something else we can try would be to open up the search menu and type in CMD. Best match, should come back with command prompts. Go ahead and right click on that and select run as administrator. If you receive a user account control prompt, select yes. And into the elevated command line window, you want to go type in SFC followed by a space forward slash scan now. Scan now is all one word attached to that forward slash out front. Hit enter on your keyboard to begin the system scan. This will take some time to run, so please be patient.
So once that's done, go ahead and close out of here and restart your computer. So hopefully at this point, your graphics driver should not be crashing while playing a Valorant, or any other game for that matter. So pretty straightforward process, guys. I do hope I was able to help you out, and I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.